What does privilege mean? And if one person gains it, does it mean somebody else loses it? Or vice versa? Privilege can mean many different things to many different people. The door analogy really hits home for me. People who have it and people who don't. Have career services departments really become a culture of haves and have nots? We must move away from this binary perspective. How might we move from so-called best practices that we now know may not be so best to new and bold practices? My name is Hassan Akmal, the Executive Director of Career Services in light of the current themes of meaningful work and purpose, challenging even our name, Career Services. What we do is much bigger than Career Services. Isn't a service you pay for highly associated with a privileged few? Wouldn't it be nice to have a name that was much more inclusive? A department within a department. Yes, you heard me right. It double downs on DEI and the data that goes along with it as they relate to students and recent alumni. We will challenge the norms and align some provocative questions that just might make you reconsider, rethink vulnerability versus a lifetime of entitlement. Enjoy. Thank you.